Hello, welcome to Fairmont Park Models. Uh, we are a division of Fairmont Homes, which is a division of Cabco Industries. Uh, the, one of the country's largest home builders, as well as park model manufacturers in the USA. Today we are focusing on one of the top models, the Country Manor 100-169. And uh, we always say at Fairmont Park Models, what's in your park model? pride ourselves on uh, giving you a lot more standards than level. So what we do use is cradle of strength, meaning that the roof rafters, sidewall studs, and floor joists are all 16 on center for durability. We also, unlike a lot of our competition and in the RV industry, we're using 2x4 uh, sidewall studs and then on top of the studs, we're putting OSB standard instead of a foam core board. On top of that, we wrap it with a wind barrier, all standard with the Fairmont Park models. Now we're going to step inside and take a look at this beauty. We've stepped inside now the 100-169, again, one of our best sellers. Uh, we've got a matching unit to it. The you know, model 10174, which is a flat floor version of this for the people that don't want to uh, walk down steps into the bedroom. Uh, as you see, this model has two bump outs, one in the dining area, one in the living area, that gives you an expansive living area that allows for two recliners, a sofa, coffee table, and two end tables with plenty of room to walk around. You don't have to step over things. What we do use in Fairmont Park models, which is the same cabinetry we use in our houses, is solid wood, hardwood cabinetry. We've got hidden hinges. We're using in-screwed styles instead of uh, glued and, and stapled. So this gives you a residential cabinet. A couple more features on this 169. The ceiling beams are optional, which gives it a nice look. We have an optional uh, island movable here versus a dinette table and chairs. Park models aren't that big to begin with, so you put the, the island where you want it when you need it, get it out of the way when you don't. Uh, we've got some extra storage, cabinetry-wise, on the island. Um, this particular plan has a hutch for more cabinetry for dishes, silverware, glasses. Look up, up top, we've got a cathedral ceiling with, in the loft, super loft. What I do like about Fairmont Park models is we're using a half-inch drywall on the internal walls versus a quarter inch panel. If you hit the competition, it's going to rattle like an RV. So it's sound, sturdy, structurally quiet. Keeps the heat in and the coolness in during the summer and winter months. The bedroom, we have two nightstands with uh, night reading lights with USB ports on both sides. And what we've done on all the country manors is put a window above the headboard area for ventilation and light to get a nice breeze cross coming up into the loft we've got some of the tallest ceiling heights in uh, the industry above the sunken bedroom 58 inches in the center at the cathedral ceiling here in the back portion of the loft in closing this 100 169 in fairmont park models it's all about Get more for what you pay, just park it.